Congrats on Naomi. The pilot was such a fun watch. I want you to tell me about the series. The pilot follows a cool, confident 16-year-old girl who loves Superman. She skateboards. She's a military kid. She's adopted. But a t an event happens in her town that, you know, shakes up everything and she uncovers her hidden destiny. How does it feel to know that Ava literally handpicked you for this role? It's great. <laughs> I've always looked up to Miss Ava and to be in this space with her is, is I'm super grateful. Yeah. In your opinion, I mean, you kind of touched on, on the things that make Naomi, Naomi. She skateboards. I feel like she is super cool fashion she obviously has some sort of power what do you think most sets her apart from other superheroes i think what sets her apart from other superheroes is that you know you one the show questions your definition of what a superhero is you don't have to wear a cape and you don't have to fight bad guys and fight crime to be a so-called superhero she's a 16 year old girl she's different in so many ways that she loves but you know, when you get your powers, does that mean that you're completely confident in it or does it mean that you uh, grapple with loving it? You also mentioned her love for Superman, which I know is a big part of the comics and I know it's gonna be a big part of the series. Kind of talk about their relationship as much as you can. I would say, you know, Naomi looks up to Superman um, because he's adopted and she's adopted. And I think that she sees him in a way that she wants to see herself, not power wise, but just um, confident and up. I think that, you know, she runs the third biggest Superman fan side in the world. And if she were to ever meet Superman, she would probably faint. She would be completely super excited. I'm hearing that she does meet Superman. Is it Tyler Hoechlin Superman? Is it a new Superman? I mean, uh, Tyler was not on set for the pilot. I do love, you know, Superman and Lois, and I think that he's that he's great. Uh, so not on set for the pilot, but we could see him, perhaps, in season one. I cannot. I'm not, I'm not sure if I can confirm or deny. That. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Are you guys talking about a season two yet? You know, of course, I, of course, I, I would love to do a season two. I think the, you know, the season two of the comics is coming out soon and this year with Brian Michael Bendis and David F. Walker. They're writing another season of the comics. So to play with that. But I also think the way that the show um, ends in season one, you'd have a lot of questions. And I think that that's with every character, not just with Naomi. And I, I really love that. Ooh, lots of cliffhangers. We're already learning about them. You're already teasing them. I'm excited. How how true to the comics do you feel like this series stays? I think that, you know, the source material is so great. And there are people who have read the comic, there are Easter eggs in it, which I love so much. But I would say that, um, you know, the comic being so new and only there being like uh, one season of it allows us to grow. So it stays true to the comics. Naomi's co costume in the comics is like really amazing. And I, I, I can't wait till people, um, I can't wait till she gets one. Oh, does she not get one in season one? You have to watch the season. <laughs> okay. Um, I know we talked about Naomi loving Superman. Who do you love as a superhero? Who do you kind of look up to? Or I really love Grant Gustin as The Flash. I think that, um, you know, Barry is someone that is very relatable, but also um, I love like, um, I just love that show. And I've always loved like uh, Melissa Benoist in um, in uh, Supergirl. Supergirl. Is there anyone you would love to, to have on the show? I think I would, ooh, like as, as an actor, I would probably love to have, you know, Grant Gustin on the show. Okay. He's so great and uh, so talented. The obvious answer is Naomi would be uh, Tyler Hecklin. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.